Hi, it's Carly McAvoy. I just wanted to introduce you to the three-dimensional shapes that you might encounter in math classes or in your regular life. A very um, common one is the sphere, which is just like a ball. The cylinder. Cylinder you can think of as like canned goods. A cuboid can also be called a rectangular prism. It can actually be called a rectangular solid. That's probably one that comes up the most in your basic math classes. A cone, like an ice cream cone. Hexagonal prism, that's because there's the base of this is a hexagon. It has six sides, and then it's also got a height to it. A square base pyramid, a pyramid that has the bottom of it is a square, and then the sides, the four sides come up to a peak. Triangular base pyramid obviously has a base with three sides or a triangle and then those three sides come to a peak. A cube is like a cuboid except that all sides are the same. The dimensions, the length, the width, and the height are all the same. And a triangular prism is a has a triangle on one side and also the other side and then those three sides meet. Not in a peak like the pyramid but they just they have sides connecting the three sides of the triangle. Of these, the most common are the cube, the cylinder, the sphere, and the cuboid. Um, the Rubik's Cube, you guys know that from playing that probably at some point in your life. Uh, all canned goods that we see here are in the shape of a cylinder. Balls are spheres. And then we also have the cuboid or rectangular prism or rectangular solid, which is the shape of like a shoebox. All right, have a fantastic day. We'll see you next time.